Welcome back to Jetline Marvel for another thrilling episode of comparing two fighter jets, the F-35 from the United States and the AMCA from India. This comparison is solely for the purpose of understanding how AMCA appears after completion, from the table drawing to real life. Since it hasn't yet reached final model, but the F-35 is a war-ready plane. The AMCA differs from the F-35 fighter jet in that it does not have vertical takeoff and landing. But, most importantly, AMCA may begin production and service in 10 to 15 years. Lockheed Martin manufactures some of the highest quality defense goods in the world, and the F-35 is one of them. HAL is a well-known Indian plane manufacturer. Let's have a look at the aircraft size and performance. The AMCA is 57.9 feet long, while the F-35 is 51.4 feet long. The AMCA has a 36.6-foot wingspan, whereas the F-35 has a 35-foot wingspan. The AMCA is 14.9 feet tall, while the F-35 is 14.4 feet tall. The AMCA has an empty weight of 12,000 kilograms, whereas the F-35 has a weight of 13,290 kilograms. AMCA has a gross weight of 18,000 kilograms, whereas F-35 has a gross weight of 22,471 kilograms. The AMCA has a fuel capacity of 6,500 kilograms, while the F-35 has a capacity of 8,275 kilograms. The AMCA is propelled by two modified GE or Safran engines that will be installed in aircraft. The F-35 is propelled by a single Pratt & Whitney F-135 afterburning turbofan with a thrust of 125 kN dry and 191 kN afterburner. The AMCA is a stealth supersonic multi-role fighter with twin engines built for the IF. The AMCA is currently envisioned as a fifth-generation fighter, but it will eventually include emerging, best-of-breed sixth-generation technologies. The AMCA would be the Indian Air Force's first fifth-generation fighter to enter service. The F-35 is a stealth multi-role fighter with a single engine and supersonic speed. Low observables, modern avionics, and sensor fusion are all features of the F-35, allowing for a high level of situational awareness and long-range lethality. The F-35's human-machine interface relies heavily on the helmet display. Rather than the preceding fighter's head-up display positioned atop the dashboard, the HMDS displays flight and battle information on the helmet visor. The AMCA can reach the ceiling height up to 65,000 feet, and the F-35 is around 50,000 feet. The AMCA has a top speed of 26.33 km per hour, whereas the F-35 has a top speed of 2,000 km per hour. The AMCA has a range of 3,240 km, whereas the F-35 has a range of up to 2,800 km. The AMCA has a combat range of up to 1620 km, while the F-35 has a range of 1239 km. The AMCA can carry a wide range of weapons. The 14 hard points with a capacity of roughly 9 tons and a single 23mm cannon it carries S-8 rocket pods, Astra Mark 1, 2, 3, and NGCCM air-to-air -air missiles, and BrahMos NG, SANT, and Rudram air-to-ground missiles. It carries laser-guided bombs, NGLGB, precision-guided munitions, HSLD, DRDO SAO, and DRDO glide bombs, among others. When it comes to the F-35 fighter jet, it features the most powerful weapon package and advanced combat capabilities. The F-35 has a single 25mm cannon, four internal hard points, and six external hard points. It has a total weapons payload of 6,800 kg. It carries AIM-120, 9X, 132, and MBDA Meteor air-to-air -air missiles. Surface-to-air missiles joint air-to-ground missiles, M-88G, M-158, Spear-3, air-to-surface and air-to-ship missiles. It is capable of carrying bombs such as Joint Direct Attack Munitions, Paveway Series, M-154, and B-61 Mod. The F-35 costs roughly $125 million, with the AMCA yet to be determined. Please share your thoughts on both fighter jets. Will the AMCA be able to obtain the fifth generation tag? Let us know in comments. Please subscribe if you are new to our channel.